Good day. My name is Joe Foy and I'm National Campaign Director for the Wilderness Committee. And welcome to Homemade News, uh, our way of telling you, our members and supporters, what's going on in the, in the world of wilderness preservation. Today, the news report is about Heshquit Point Creek, an intact valley in Clackwood Sound. This summer, Heshquit Point Creek hit the news and the uh, Wilderness Committee sent an expedition out to see what was happening. Our investigation team headed for Tofino in the heart of Clackwood Sound where we charted an aircraft from Atlio Air. Our goal was to fly the length of Clackwood Sound to the northwestern portion, the most remote, remote portion, to check out reports of logging road building near Heshquit Point Creek. Below us we could see that Heshquit Point Creek was carpeted in old growth forest. We could also see where recent road building had put a, a scar across the hillside just to the left of the valley. We could see that old road building and clear cuts were quite close to the ocean and made a plan to land close to the beach, get on the beach and begin our expedition there. The trail led from the beach up to the logging road, the Stewartson Main logging road, uh, where we began to walk along and look for evidence of logging. It didn't take us long uh, to find it. After making our way past a black bear, uh, we found what we came to find, which was the area where Colson Logging Company had cut a swath of forest down in preparation for building a logging road. This logging road would lead into the heart of Heshka Point Creek Valley, an intact valley. This is what we've come to see and to stop. So we're in Heshquit Point Creek Valley. Uh, it's a long name for a little valley 
of uh, ancient forests. This is old growth forest, and Heshkut Point Creek is in Clackwood Sound. In fact, this is one of the pristine areas of Clackwood Sound that for 15 years, ever since 1993, logging companies have stayed out of the pristine areas. But now we've got one logging company, Colson Logging Company, which has just cleared a road right-of-way right into the edge of Heshkut Point Creek and felled these uh, ancient trees and that's why we're here. To take pictures of that, to record that, and to once again say to the world that we need to save Clockwood Sound. We've got a road company here, company gone bad, that's trying to once again log in the pristine areas of Clockwood Sound and it just ain't right. A team of Wilderness Committee volunteers headed down to the valley bottom of Heshquit Point Creek to see the ancient forest that grows along the creekside. Meanwhile, negotiations continue between the logging company, the Central Region First Nations, who are the owners of the company, and environmental groups over the fate of the intact areas of Clackwood Sound. We are hopeful that a hold on logging can continue for the next number of months until a solution can be found. Please contact Premier Campbell and ask him to step in with funding for local communities so that this vision can be realized. This is this edition of Homemade News. Thanks for watching. This is Joe Foy for the Wilderness Committee. See you next time. It's impressive old growth forest we've come across in this expedition and I hope that someday it can be preserved.